Hello friends, my name is Dr. Purudhavan and today in this video, I will tell you what kind of vegetables are safe for a kidney failure patient. In a kidney failure patient, all kind of non-veg diet is prohibited because it contains protein in high amount and it causes increased levels of creatinine. So we have to go for vegetarian diet. But lots of vegetables contains potassium in high amount and this high potassium may cause other complications like heart attack or even death. So we have to select vegetables very carefully. Whenever you go to grocery shop, make sure you avoid all kind of vegetables which are grown below the surface of earth and brown in color. For example, potato, sweet potato, beetroot, lotus stem, any other vegetable which is local in your area, brown in color and tuberous in nature as it contains potassium in high amount naturally. And along with tutti vegetables, we have to avoid all kind of green leafy vegetables as they also contain potassium in higher amount. Vegetable like coriander, parsley, mint, spinach has to be avoided completely. Now you must be thinking if you avoid all these vegetables, what kind of vegetables are suitable for kidney failure patient. So, any vegetable which is grown as a fruit on a plant or a creeper contains potassium in lower amount and they are safe for consumption by a kidney failure patient. For example, round gout, bitter grout, snake grout, tomato, okra, brinjal and flowers like cauliflower and cabbage, lettuce can be taken by a kidney failure patient. Now a small list of vegetables are displayed on your skin. These vegetables are safe for consumption by kidney failure patient as it contains potassium in lower amount. So next time, whenever you visit a grocery shop, keep this golden rule in mind. Always avoid brown rooty vegetable and green leafy vegetable. In the description, I have given the complete list of vegetable and fruits which are safe for a kidney failure patient. So you can visit that link to download complete diet chart. There is one more way to judge whether the vegetable is safe for consumption and that is by the help of Google search. Search the name of vegetable along with the potassium content. If the amount of potassium content is around 200, that means that particular vegetable is safe for consumption by a kidney failure patient. And if the value of potassium comes above 200, like uh, 250, 300, 400, that means that vegetable contains potassium in high amount and we have to avoid that particular vegetable. Now, if you want to consume a vegetable which is high in potassium like potato, that is a brown tuberous vegetable which is grown below the surface of earth and contains potassium in high amount and which is not set for kidney failure patient but you still want to consume that particular vegetable. You can do that with the help of leaching process. Leaching is a process in which we drain out the excess amount of potassium from that vegetable. For leaching, we have to peel the vegetable first. We have to cut down the, into the smaller pieces. We have to keep that vegetable soak in cold water for next three to four hours. After that, we have to drain the excess amount of water. Now the vegetable is safe for consumption by kidney failure patient. Leaching process has to be avoided in low potassium vegetables because when we leach any vegetable along with the potassium, all kind of essential nutrition also gets drained off. And consumption of such kind of food for a longer period may cause deficiencies in the body which can lead to further complication in the life of a kidney failure patient. I hope with the help of this video, you have figured out how to select vegetable for a kidney failure patient. In the next video, I will explain what kind of fruits are safe for consumption by kidney failure patient. With this, allow me to say goodbye. See you in the next video. Till then, take care.